So now that we're back in our HTML, let's actually create our footer over here. I'm going to say footer and over here we're going to create a div, right? This is going to be a div that's going to have a class of container. So it's going to be probably somewhere over here, right? So we're going to say div and this is going to have a class and it's going to be container over here like this. And then we're going to add a, a heading to going to say heading to over here and we're going to say follow us over here and then we're going to add a an order list over here like this we're going to say on our list and over here we're going to add right away a class a list in line right so I'm going to say that this is going to have a class and this is going to be a list in line right this is going to be one of those bootstrap classes where everything we write is going to be right away displayed in line now, what we need right now is actually our font awesome, right? And I already, in order to save the time, actually got a font awesome. But just to quickly uh, go over again what we needed for a font awesome, we were going to go over here to Google. We're going to say font awesome, right? Then, if we go to font awesome and just click it over here, they have somewhere, obviously, this is going to be a uh, download right so if we click that download we need to drag this uh, folder over here to our uh, file right to our folder so then we can actually uh, link it right so if we have over here somewhere get started right so we have we can get cdn or we can just download it right away and again guys i have the video for that so if you want to check it out or if you're not comfortable with this then uh, just go to this uh, video that I have and it's pretty much explains how to work with font awesome just to save time What we're gonna do is we're basically gonna get to our font awesome min, right? So we're just gonna copy this. This is gonna be in our folder So I'm just gonna make this smaller and I'm gonna find where it is my font awesome So we're gonna go all the way back to the head, right? Because this is what we need to include in our head so over here we're going to go somewhere and let's say above from uh, Google Fonts. We're going we're gonna to say that this is going to be a font awesome or here like this. And we're just going to copy this, right? This link, right? We're going to paste the link because we have downloaded already this folder or we can download only this one file, right? I just always drag this folder uh, so, so it stays within my folder, but we can just pick this file. And what we need to do over here is we just need to change this path, right? So we need to change the path over here, what's written over here. So I'm just gonna uh, click over here. You can see that I have font awesome. Then I'll have a CSS and then we want font, font awesome in, right? So now we have font awesome. So I'm just gonna close this one over here, go all the way back to the bottom and we're gonna create a list item. List item is gonna have a anchor tag over here like this and we're going to say that this is going to have a i right this is going to be i element and we're going to say that this is going to have a class here like this and we're going to say fa fa facebook right so fa fa facebook over here like this and if we close it out right this is our little facebook over here so we cannot see it right now but but don't worry about it and we're going to fix it in a second. So I'm just going to copy this uh, four times, right? Over here, we're going to write a different one. This is going to be a Twitter. Here, we're going to say that this is going to be a Instagram. Over here like this. And then we're going to say that this is going to be a, a Google Plus. Google Plus, right? And you can see that now we have a list in line. You can see right away how they're all lining up, right? Otherwise, they would be uh, sitting on top of each other, right? And here for this container, we're just going to say that this is going to be text center, right? For a This is going to be our bootstrap class. And after that, what we want after this uh, on our list, still within the container, we're going to create a heading 3. We're going to say that this heading 3 is going to be a copy copyright over here like this and we're going to say copy uh, right something like this we're going to say 2017 and let's say by coding addict right 
something like this and again it's hard to see right now because of our brick wall that we have done all the way there but the text is there so now let's go to our uh, CSS and actually style it right so we're gonna go as well over here all the way to the bottom right and we're gonna start start styling everything what we need to do now let's just create a little bit more space over here and we're gonna say that uh, this is gonna be a footer footer like this and we're just gonna say that we want a footer and footer font awesome right so we need to include this class right because this is the class that we're using for font awesome you can see that it's selecting over here and we're gonna say that we want a different color and let's say the color we want is let's say blue right so we're gonna go with blue now we change the color now we obviously want them bigger so we're gonna write font size and we're gonna want size let's say four ems right so now you can see how much bigger they right away got and obviously if we want we can make them even more bigger if that's our preference right and then after that what we want is a footer three so heading three so we're gonna say footer heading three and here we would want a color right and we're gonna say that color is gonna be something like red right so this is gonna be my uh, coding addict right and after that uh, we're actually pretty much done with a footer right maybe the only thing is let's check it out what we had over here all right so we had something over here we had a uh, heading two right so let's maybe just change this one to heading three also so it would be the same and what we were going to do is we're going to save this and then maybe let's go over here and we're going to say that we want a font size over here i don't know let's say like four ems right maybe too big three three is fine right so now we're done pretty much with the footer and now we're ready to add our uh, jquery plugins right the scrolling back the light box right and obviously the animations right and we're also gonna add a wow gs then the animations are gonna be happening so let's go ahead and let's actually download our animations and our jquery plugins <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,